You need to stop mindlessly consuming content. You, your brain, when you're on these apps, you're on Reels and Instagram, YouTube Shorts, TikTok, whatever, your brain is on autopilot mode. You're not thinking actively. You're not actively participating. You're just a slave to your phone. You're consuming the content, not for yourself, not actively learning. All that is, it's just a pool fishing for your attention. You're not gaining anything doing that. What I recommend you start doing is that you quit consuming content and you start producing. The first step is just delete your fucking apps. These apps and delete them. Delete all the content consumption you do. You need to seriously consider, do I want to be in control of my life or do I want the people behind these apps to control my life? Because as it is right now, you're a slave to the algorithms behind these apps. Your mind is wired to, whenever you get bored, whenever you have a little bit of boredom, you're a little uncomfortable, you get the impulse to go on these apps. And you will just look at your phone screen, just click on the app automatically, and the shorts open for you. You don't have to click. And then you waste your time, you spend an hour diving through these shorts, going down the loophole, wasting your time. And this is the same guy who wanted to be successful, start improving his life, start working out, doing all this thing, maybe starting like a business or something, complaining he doesn't have the time of day to do this, when in reality he wasted all his time on this app. You need to be more mindful of what you're doing with your life. You're, most of you guys are not conscious of what you're doing on a daily basis. You go through your life like a fucking NPC. You go on your phone whenever you get bored, you go scroll, the only job that content does is to hold your attention. Your attention is a super valuable thing. And they use it because it helps them improve their businesses. People advertise their businesses on these apps. They put ads up and then they get your, your attention. And then every one out of like every 100 people is going to click on the ad and buy the thing. Buying the shit off TikTok ads. They're getting your attention. They're making you spend money. This might be one of your only chances to get off. How are you expected to be successful if you can't even control what you do? You can't even control what you do on your phone. So right now, if I were you, what I would do, right now, if I were you, what I would do, I would delete all of my social media apps. No more Instagram, no more YouTube, no more TikTok, no more Twitter. Anywhere where you consume content, you're gonna have a bunch of free time and you're not gonna know what to do with it. You need to start working out. Start working out, get in good physical condition. Start being more mindful of the food you put in your mouth. People can't even control what food they put in their mouth. Start controlling the food you eat. Start drinking more water. You know, it's not an information problem. You know what you have to do. Your only problem is you lack the discipline to get stuff done and you don't control, you're not in control of your own mind. You're dragged around by your addictions and your little dopamine hits. The algorithms of all these apps control you. You're not controlled, you're not in control of yourself. Because, you know what, if you were in control of yourself and you were able to live your life how you want it to be, it'd be completely different. You're not in control of your own life. How often do you do things that you want to do? Like, I'm not saying, like, I want to watch TikTok. No, things you actually want to do. like. You say, I want to work out because I want a good body, and then you don't. You say you want to do something, but you don't do it. You, don't, you never do what you want to do. It's a problem of discipline and taking action. Taking action is you doing the deed, deleting the apps like I told you to do, and to start working your ass off. Start doing small things. Nothing's going to get done from you watching this video. This could be your last chance to fix your life. This video could be the last time somebody with actual good intention on YouTube tries to provide value for you. And you're just going to miss it and you're going to go on your life. Just go to the next video. So like I said before, stop mindlessly consuming content for your brain from all your addictions and stuff.